an occasion for committed fans and neutrals alike. This is the North London derby when we expect the unexpected. Stay with us on EA TV. Hello everyone, it's an ideal day for football here in London at the Tottenham Hotspur Stadium. My name is Derek Ray and sitting alongside me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It is Tottenham Hotspur versus Arsenal. Thanks Derek. Well often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. Havertz foiling his opponent completely. This is the starting lineup for Tottenham Hotspur. Dejan Kulusevski plays with Timo Werner out wide and operating up front today is Hume Min Son. A glorious chance. It's gone in. Spurs take the lead in the derby. And just listen to what it means to the fans. Well, just look how he holds off the defender. He keeps his balance and he still hits the target. What a good goal that is. Game restarted by Arsenal. A wake-up call for the Arsenal players, perhaps. Can they construct a response? William Saliba. How oh, can they open up the defence here? And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. Played over, in a good position to clear it away. Now far from a smooth challenge. Now will the referee produce a card? And a yellow card, it's going to be Stewart. Yeah, the ref's got that right. It's a yellow card all day long. Oh, good strike! an exquisite goal absolute perfection well here it is again and honestly I can't believe he's taken this on it's an incredible strike to beat the goalkeeper from that sort of range could he have done better I'm not sure but let's just admire the goal stunning free kick So back underway following the equaliser. James Madison. Pat Matar Saar. A Spurs free kick it's going to be. Well, that one has promise. Oh, that's a really good run. And he takes on the shot. No way through. And that's how to dispossess your opponent. Arsenal's free kick here. Saar. On to Werner. Given away by Spurs. Kai Havertz. Likes to run with the ball at his feet. What a powerful effort, but just wide.
and snuffed out the danger immediately. Kulusevski. Passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. And it took a little nick before it went over the touchline. So a throw in here. Clearly took a touch on the way out of play. So a throw in to come. Well, as you can see, Arsenal have had most of the ball. But with the talent they have on show here, the lack of quality in the attacking third has been a real disappointment. They need to play with more urgency to win this one. Half time then here in the English capital. So here we go into the second half at the home of Tottenham Hotspur. I'm trying to switch the play, but he overhit it. James Madison and a tidy challenge. Kai Havertz. Well, as you can see, Havertz does so well to create the chance with this dribble. And what a strike by Havertz. That really is a clinical finish. There was no stopping that. So the ball is rolling again. 2-1 the score. What's going to happen next? Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. Perfect tackle. This is a message for Tyler Berry. That's Tyler Berry. Can you please make yourself known to the nearest steward? Thank you. Rice. Well, it was a promising avenue of attack, but the momentum has been halted. And you wouldn't be surprised to see the card handed out. And following the infringement, a caution. Yeah, no surprise there. That was always going to be a booking. Well, I have a feeling we're going to see this time and time again tonight. It's a fantastic bit of technique just to get that much lateral movement on the ball. Wonderful strike. So back underway at 3-1. Bukayo Saka and Arsenal now find themselves in potentially a dangerous position well it really looked as though that was going to be another goal from him well a chance for his second there probably should have done a bit better there really played over and a struggle to get it away properly Rice determined defending oh that's textbook goalkeeping An encouraging Arsenal move, and he's through here. Oh, the crossbar is still reverberating. Ambitious effort. Oh, did so well to deny him.
Can someone get on the end of this? Saar. Now we're inside the final 15 minutes. Well, he's beaten his opponent. Has eyes for goal. Great defending. Bisuma. Firing it towards goal. Great block again. Effective press. And he takes it away. Well, beaten easily here. Can he get one back? Oh, he saved it well. And a change for Spurs at this juncture. He's driven in the corner. And cleared away. Just have to make sure they don't get caught on the counter-attack. And in with a real chance. There's the goal. Surely now that is that. Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive. And then the shot could not be hit any better. Struck with such venom. Great goal. Goals in plentiful supply. 4-1 currently. And a big chunk of added time here. A minimum of five minutes. Just the challenge that was required. So there goes the final whistle. It ends at a victory for Arsenal. Maximum points for them. What did you make of it all? Well, I would say they're the perfect counter-attacking team at present. They force their opponents to pass into midfield. They win the ball back and then they break with pace and precision. And that's what happened again today. 